So A is the point with coordinates 1, 3. B is the point with coordinates minus 2, minus 1. And we've got a line L with equation 3y equals 4 minus 2x. And we need to know if A to B, this distance here, is parallel to this line. So if two lines are parallel, so parallel, that means they've got the same gradient. means the same gradient. So two lines are parallel if they go in the same direction. And if they go in the same direction, they must have the same gradient. Um, so let's look at the two points here first. So A, B, um, the gradient is, so if we've got two points, we use the formula um, changing Y over changing X or Y2 minus Y1 over X2 minus X1. So this is, we'll go X1, Y1, X2, Y2. So we've got minus 1, minus 3 over x2 is minus 2, minus 1. So that's minus 4 over minus 3, which is just 4 over 3. Because a minus divided by minus is a plus. Negative divided by negative is a positive. So it's got a gradient of 4 over 3, AB. L, so we know it's 3y equals 4 minus 2x. Now, it's hard to tell from this, but what you should know is the gradient of a straight line is in the form y equals mx plus c, where m is the gradient. So we need to rearrange what they've given us so it's in the right form. So to get y by itself, I'm going to divide everything by 3. So 4 over 3 minus 2 over 3 x. And the switch around the x and the, the mx and the c so minus 2 over 3x plus 4 over 3. Now, are they the same gradient? Well, this one's got a gradient of minus 2 over 3. This one's got a gradient of 4 over 3. So they are not parallel. Not parallel because they've got different gradients. So not parallel, different gradients. I should really write a proper sentence. I should say they have different gradients, or even because they have different gradients.